Señor Presidente. What can true yarns do to Serviana? True yarns have long memories. We remember how so-called civilized nations treated us when we needed them most. Are you concerned about the terroristas who call themselves Libertad? You're an orphan, see? Why do you want to run? Remember, Danny, Castillo has kept you an orphan. I only see you. So why are you here? I watched Castillo order a whole boat of our people shot to death. And I want to know who's going to help me take him down. Okay. Castillo's got, what, 300,000 troops? I count six burnt out guerrillas, and you with a bullet to the leg. You can shoot, so shoot. You have rules. You might kill, but you're no killer. You know I'm not a guerrilla, right? Everything got another purpose. That usually work? 50-50. Size, Danny. I know exactly who you are. Hi there, I'm Navid Khavari, Narrative Director of Far Cry 6, and I'm so excited to represent our team and finally show you our game in action. With Far Cry 6, we're going to throw you into our most ambitious open world yet, Yara, an island deep in the heart of the Caribbean, filled with rich, tropical ecosystems alongside decaying urban landscapes. Yara is an island of contrasts. Isolated and frozen in time, for over 50 years after a violent revolution cut it off from the rest of the world, it now finds itself on the verge of collapse. Last year, we introduced you to Yara's Presidente, Anton Castillo, with an amazing performance by Giancarlo Esposito. A Castillo must be a lion, for Yara is full of lambs. The reception we've had to Anton and Diego has been incredible, and we're just getting started. Anton is a man hell-bent on returning Yara to his idea of its former glory. And while his motivations are far more complex than they seem, the cost of his vision will be paid in blood. If a dog refuses to break, then we must put them down. To achieve his dream for Yara and his son Diego, Anton has clamped down on freedoms, instituted brutal social reforms, and cast anyone who speaks out against him into forced labor. His oppression of the Yaran people has pushed the island to the brink of revolution. When tyranny is law, revolution is order. Yara, once considered a jewel of the Caribbean, is now a powder keg. And you are the match. Your name is Danny Rojas, and you'll experience the revolution through Danny's eyes right from the beginning. Born and raised in Yara's capital city, you're a young military dropout who wants nothing to do with Anton or the revolution. You just want to get the hell out of Yara. But once you're face to face with Anton's brutality, you realize that the only chance to live free is to lead an army of guerrillas into a new revolution with the very soul of the island at stake. And I need you here with us, man. At the start of your journey, you'll get to pick your identity and customize your look while you navigate the ranks of
of the guerrilla movement. Every aspect of the game has been developed with the goal to make you feel like a guerrilla fighter, battling an asymmetric war against Anton and his army. The guerrilla fantasy is all about making one guerrilla feel like a thousand. Embracing this was at the core of how we crafted our gameplay, our world, and the characters you'll meet along the way. In Yara, you'll find other guerrillas, black market dealers, and everyday Yarans who each have their own reasons for joining the cause, including our friendly guerrilla Juan Cortez, a master of invention, an architect of revolution. He's our guerrilla teacher. And class starts now. Wapo, you listen. Rule 16. A guerrero's revolution never ends. Always another war, another cantina, another ugly bartender. Juan Cortez? What do you think gave it away, Wapo? This is a fucking waste of time. Can you whistle? What? Nah, you can't whistle. Not bad, Danny, but we're just getting started. Rule number one, a good guerrilla is a hidden guerrilla. Puerto el perro, se acabó la rabia. We lead our operations in secret camps across the country. Here, guerrillas live, Kaboom! train, and plan. Small pack. We go in, grab our people, kill whoever gets in our way. By smuggling in supplies, we'll add some piss and fire to our movement. You got that right. Camp chef, black market dealers. These safe havens got everything a guerrilla needs. Even do-it-yourself vehicles. You're gonna love it, Danny. Rule number two. A good guerrilla masters their environment. This land is your home, Danny. I'm sure you know every inch of it. From the bloodthirsty jungles, and postcard shorelines, the dead-end towns, and our friendly capital city. How you get around is up to you. Good girl. If you want to play it safe, take our secret paths carved in the dirt of old revolutions. Hola, Danny. How you doing? Or take a risk and operate in plain sight of Castillo's assholes. Go ahead and hide your weapons to blend in. Bribes. What do you got? Mm -hmm. Sabotage. Interceptions. You don't always need to be a loudmouth, Danny. Christmas trees? Do we even grow those here? Mexicans pay crazy money for this. How you think El Presidente funded Maria's new face? Okay. Go through. Rule number three. Fucked up situations call for fucked up solutions. Hey, he's not here. If you expect the reinforcements, I got news for you. You're an army of one against an army of thousands. And when shit gets real, we make use of whatever we have. We call that resolver. That means absolutely everything from sardine cans, goddamn batteries, to old motorcycle engines have been built into equipment. And some very unique, deadly weapons. Now we're fucking talking. This, the Supremo Backpacks. Handcrafted by yours truly. Each one will make you feel and fight with the power of a goddamn guerrilla army. Give me left. I'm a you and I both know. You want this. For a guerrilla. For a guerrilla, the shit my pants rush of an ambush. The taste of sweet victory. Have you freed your people from tyrants? It's. It's. It's fun. 
Oh, and the final rule. A good guerrilla always brings a friend along for moral support. So there you have it. Far Cry 6 will be available on October 7th on PC and consoles. We hope you enjoyed this first glimpse of gameplay. We have a lot more coming soon that we can't wait to share with you. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time. Thank you.